Welcome to La Vida Rosa. I'm your host Pinky and today I'm going to be trying the e.l.f. 16 hour camo concealer and I'm also going to be doing a 16 hour wear test. We're going to see if this baby works. But before I begin, I'd like for everyone to check out my website, La Vida Rosa Style, where you can find cute earrings like the ones I'm wearing right now. These are my exclamation earrings, by the way. <laughs> so make sure you check out that link down below. Also, don't forget to like, comment, and... <laughs> subscribe and without further ado let's get into this video okay guys so this is what we're all here for right but i had to make sure i laid down a good foundation to give this a fighting chance since i am going to be doing a wear test first i had to use my hyaluronic acid which will moisturize my face without creating a lot of grease then i use my fenty beauty primer which helps my makeup last all day then I want to use a proven good long lasting foundation, which is the Maybelline 24 hour foundation. And it is full coverage as you can see. And so now that I've laid that great foundation, it's time to move on to the concealer. This is the e.l.f. 16 hour camo concealer and it's full coverage matte. So not only does this last 16 hours, but it is also supposed to be full coverage and cover all the circles and also great for me and my oily skin. It's matte, so I'm super excited. That's the main reason why I decided to buy and try this because if this works and it's only $5, like only $5, you cannot be a good $5 concealer. I'm gonna go ahead and apply this to all the places that I usually conceal I purchased this from Ulta and when I got there they only had this color that would be good for me I feel like I probably could have went a shade darker but you know it'll just be like a highlight the wand reminds me of this Tarte Shape Tape wand and I was going to do a comparison of the two, but it's not the same color. I would have been looking crazy. When I apply it, it is very creamy. I'm going to go ahead and blend, blend this out. This is definitely full coverage. It doesn't say anything about brightening, but it definitely brightens your under eye and it definitely camouflages any sort of darkness you have. Like, it's definitely doing that. And it's like covering like any blemishes that I had, it's completely covered. Like if the foundation did not cover it, this concealer is definitely covering it. If you have super dark circles, I feel like this is perfect for you. Super blendable with a sponge and very beginner friendly. What I like most about this concealer is that it's full coverage and it hides all the blemishes without looking cakey. Like it doesn't look cakey at all. That's why I wish I could have found a color closer to my skin tone because I feel like it would really, like y'all would really get a better feel. Because in person, like it just looks flawless i don't know if that's translating but it just looks flawless y'all i'm gonna set it with sasha buttercup powder i'm using sasha buttercup powder to set because i know it's a great setting powder and it's long lasting and using the morphe setting spray i set everything in place all right so i'm just gonna apply the rest of my makeup and i'll be right back Okay, y'all, so here is my face all done up. So y'all saw how impressed I was with the concealer. So far, so good. So the next step is to do the wear test. And usually my wear tests are for 12 hours, but this one is for 16. Whew. That's why I woke up extra early because I'm like, I know this is gonna last forever. So it's almost 6.20 right now. So this test will end around 10 p.m. It has an A plus right now. We'll see what the grade will be at the end of this test. Next clip. Okay, y'all, so it's been around 10 hours and everything is looking super oily, but the concealer is holding up. I actually have not touched up at all today. I left my powder at home, so 
hopefully with a little bit of powder it will sop up all this grease so i'm just gonna in case you're wondering what i'm touching up with i'm using the elf blotting powder i already did a 12 hour wear test using this and this is the bomb like long story short buy this it's only six dollars but yeah my face is looking it's actually looking decent now after i've gotten rid of all the oil my face actually looks decent and back in order like i said my under eyes are looking exceptional after touching up so the concealer definitely holds up for 10 hours i'll check back in at 16 to let you know girl okay y'all at this point it's been well over 16 hours it's 10 49 y'all see my face y'all see how greasy i look okay but even with how greasy i look that concealer is intact it's intact y'all and then even right underneath my eyes i don't know if you could tell on camera it's matte like it's matte right here let me see if i can it's matte right here like right underneath my eyes no oil except for right here i basically haven't touched up since that last check-in that's why i'm looking so oily and greasy so we're gonna see how this touches up after 16 hours y'all oh my goodness i'm just gonna take a little bit more powder what i see that has happened with me touching up is um because i was so oily whenever i dusted some powder right here it did break up a little bit please don't mind my nails i'm like well, i'm in between nails right now but um it did break up a little bit i don't know if y'all can see that it did break up a little bit it was still intact before i did that um maybe next time i just press the powder in instead of like brushing it as far as the 16 hour test I do feel like for the most part it did hold up I mean it was still matte even right underneath my eyes if I had not brushed some of it away I think it would have been all right and it was so lightweight all day y'all I barely felt it all day it was so lightweight it stayed matte for the most part so I feel like it did its job I really don't know who's gonna be wearing makeup for 16 hours I know for me whenever I wear makeup I like to take it off as soon as I get home I'm gonna go ahead and give it an A, five stars, whatever you want to say. I'm gonna give it the top level of praise for a five dollar concealer lasting for 16 hours. I honestly didn't have too much faith that it would, but now that it has, I'm definitely gonna be using this concealer a lot more because five dollars, how can you beat that? And it lasts and it actually is full coverage and it does the job of a tart shape tape concealer you cannot beat it so that's it for my video let me know what you guys think down below have you ever tried this concealer do you plan on trying it and yeah i hope you enjoyed this video and i'll see you in my next one peace